all right now that we know where our video timeline is saved at what we want to do now is we want to go over these five tabs over here in our bin so this is the area that you're going to be working in the majority of the time is on this timeline and in this bin all right so we got media generators media generators is all the different aspects of video texting you got credit rolls when you see movies going off you got you know different credit rolls and if you put your cursor over the different um, tabs you'll be able to see the different effects of your text how the text gonna come on how it's gonna go off the screen pretty dope right all right so you got noise textures you got different patterns ha solid colors look at that solid colors this is gonna come very in handy for backgrounds you got test patterns titles and text that's what we're going over today is basic video text you can see these different motions as a, as you put your cursor over each text effect it'll show you what it's do uh, what it do and how it's gonna come and go off the screen all right so sample text we're gonna bring this when I click on it you're gonna see um, the red circle with the X uh, I mean with the line through it when you grab it you can't put it anywhere else but on the timeline when you put it on the timeline you can see the square taking shape all right bam then this window opens sample text I'm gonna click in the box and I'm gonna rename this as basic video text all right so I'm gonna make it a little bit um, smaller so I'm gonna double click on the letters in here to make sure I can change the font make them about 36 all right so I got them about 36 I'm gonna grab two more sample text and bring them down here as you can see it automatically set each text box at 10 seconds so we got 10 20 I'm gonna grab this and throw it right there for 30 seconds all right so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hit the X to get that off the, get that off the screen for right now this is how if you change the words if you change the text you can be able to change um, how you want it so this little green timeline right here on each one that's how you open up your text and change it so I'm gonna title this one um, no let me try that again I'm gonna hit control Z to undo all right so I'm gonna click back in here and I'm gonna just take off the word text so this one is just gonna say sample and then I'm gonna click right here I'm gonna hit that timeline and I'm gonna take off the word sample so now this one just say text then I'm gonna click off alright so I got three different slides I got basic video text sample text those are three different video slides on my timeline see that all right now what I want to do is up here in my media generators I got titles and text now I'm gonna go to solid colors this is where the solid colors come in handy I want my basic background to be red voila and what I just did was let me click off by hitting this red X what I just did was I created this was one track you see track number one track number two anytime you grab something you automatically create a whole new track so if I click over here on my timeline voila basic video text you can see the background there's different levels to this all right so this is the first level which is track one this is track two right here I'm gonna put my cursor on the end of this 10 seconds right here and what it do is it go from an arrow now you see two arrows going different directions with a small box on the left side and I want to click on here and then I can drag it each way out any way I want to I can shorten it I can shorten this um, background clip or I can drag it all the way out to 30 seconds it's pretty dope right and then you can see as it hit 30 second it shows this little highlight that shows that it's exactly 30 seconds all right so this is my 30 second video simple as that I got my basic video text I got sample and text all right so this is a basic 30 seconds video and now we're going to move on to rendering video into my folder.